Hello and welcome to Junk Drawer Magic, the show where we teach you how to boggle the mind using items you'd find in your junk, junk drawer. drawer. Jinx, now you owe me a Coke. Josh, we're in the middle of a show. Well then, you better hurry up, people are watching. Fine. We're all out of Coke, but I have a feeling you knew that. That's fine, I can just use this uh, empty can. I essentially have free soda refills for life. Here, just uh, check this out. And now watch this. All we do is give this a little rub, and now it's sealed again. Whoa, that's insane. You're an amazing magician. Thanks. Thanks. Jinx, you owe me a Coke. Would an explanation work? Deal. We'll show you how to do this next. Ready to bring your soda back from the dead? I'll never drink water again. Let's go to the junk drawer. For this trick, we'll need a full soda can, a piece of paper, a pair of scissors, a black marker, a glass, and a thumbtack. So to start off, you're gonna take your thumbtack and poke a small hole in the top of the can. This will cause some liquid to shoot out. So make sure you have a sink or some paper towels ready. Let's try. Cue the elevator music. After you get that done, you are going to gently crush the can just so that it looks even more like it's empty. Make sure you do this slowly or else there might be a lot of soda pouring out. Next, we're gonna make it look like the can has already been opened on top by cutting out a small piece of paper that kind of resembles the top of the can. Then you're gonna color in the piece of paper with a black marker. So now that the prep work is done, all you have to do is cover the hole with your thumb and then swirl it around a little bit until it returns to its original form. Then just wipe the paper away, and then pop the can open, and pour it into a glass. Yes, I'm so ready for this trick. Let's do this. Thanks for watching Junk Drawer Magic, where we show you how to make the impossible possible. That was a pretty fun soda trick, Josh. But I have a better one. <laughs> Face it, Akira. There's no way your soda trick could be better than mine. Oh, yeah?
Today, we will not just be learning magic, we'll be learning blood magic. Kira, we made a promise to the Ancient One that we would never again use blood magic for entertainment purposes. You just don't like blood magic because it makes you faint. Well, that also. Please. Okay, fine, but just one trick. Awesome. All we'll need is a little bit of blood. Bye.